done. Please, you must help. It is my wife, my beautiful Adina. Something dark claimed her wayfarer. It's using her like a puppet. By Walker's breath, I think it might be Daedra. It's been luring people into the ruins. My wife is down there. Please help me. Oh, stranger, you are kind beyond measure. I called upon Adina's twin sister, Izara, two days ago. She's a powerful maid, you see. I thought she'd deal with the monster and be back by sundown, but she still has not returned. I hope you can find her. It's called the Nilata Ruins. Holland's elders say it was the site of an old alien fortress. I don't know if that's true. All I know is that it's a decent place for grazing. At least it used to be. I am sorry I'm not a historian. I bring my goats here to graze. My mother always said the grass here was finer. The ruins made it so. One of my smallest found a doorway and ran inside. I gave chase and found. Well, now I don't know what I found. She seemed so beautiful. Well, yes. I found a talisman in the dark and a beautiful spirit appeared. She called herself Anexial. Beautiful Anexial. It's... it's not important. She deceived me. She said she needed a vessel. Someone with magic in their blood. Yes. I'm not proud of it. My wife is lovely, but so meek, so quiet. Anexial and I had so much in common. She was light-hearted and smart. Seductive. It doesn't matter now. All that matters is my wife's safety. I just want to hold her again. I didn't know what else to do. If I had told anyone in town, they might have lynched me on the spot. Consorting with Daedra. It is unforgivable. Izara is a powerful mage. She is also Edina's identical twin. It just seemed like the only thing to do. Yes. We Red Guards take care to avoid magic, but Izara was never ashamed. She studied long and long in both Daggerfall and Wayrest. She's a true sorcerer. Her and Adina both have magic in their blood. Adina is just better at hiding it. I didn't. That is, I didn't tell her everything. If she knew what I had done, she might have turned me to salt or set me on fire. I may deserve those things, but not until I see my beloved wife free of that monster. Please, I need your help. We were patrolling the ruins. Rumor was that Red Guard insurgents were camped out here storing food and supplies. It didn't take long for the spiders to find us. Soldiers started disappearing, one at a time. I beg you, help me find them. We've no time to request help from our troops in Holland Stand. And the soldiers will die unless someone saves them. The spiders trussed their victims up and dragged them deeper into the ruins. We'll pay you for your help. Thank you. Take this ice rune. Captain Jamel gave it to me to freeze the webs trapping the others. 
It should make them brittle enough for our soldiers to break free. I think so. I took a knife to the wound to let the venom seep out. I don't know if it'll do any good, but I think the numbness in my legs has started to wear off. Might just be wishful thinking, though. There's something about these runes. I can't say for sure, but I think they're haunted. Last night, my mate Crotius said he heard whispers. Said it sounded like his mother or some such. By morning, he'd vanished. This place is evil. Pure and simple. You don't know? Well, this is awkward. The Seventh Imperial Legion has taken ownership of the city. Hey, I'm just a foot soldier. All I know is we took it with very little resistance. It was a welcome surprise. Rumor has it Holland's stand has been besieged more than once. We expected heavy casualties, but we're blessed with very few. Done for. At last, I'm free. escape. I thought I'd never escape. Look, it's the stranger who saved us. My soldiers have been returning one at a time. Some still complain of numbness. Some are half blind. But they're alive. That's what matters. Thank you. Yes, of course. To oblivion with this whole campaign folly and the Seventh Legion. As you can see, my men are securing their gear and preparing for the march back to Cyrodiil. It's... A long journey, but it'll be good to fight where we're needed. Spiders. Najan. He finds yet another person to do a husband's work for him. Pathetic. Don't concern yourself with my wounds. The door to the ruins has been sealed by an alien spell key. You must destroy the focus stones protecting it so we can get inside. I thank you for your concern, but I am well versed in restorative magics. I will recover quickly. Mephala's web grows tighter by the minute. Meet me at the spell key in the center of the ruins once you've destroyed the four focus stones. Good luck. Yes, you appear wise and well-traveled. Surely you have heard of her. Mafala is the demon prince of murder, secrets, and seduction. Some call her the web spinner, like a spider. Mafala is always weaving a web of intrigue and terror. Unfortunately, I believe my precious Adina has been ensnared. Directly? No. I doubt that Mafala would take an interest in the affairs of a goat farmer and his wife. 
but the web spinner has many servants. A secluded ruin, a foolish, lustful farmer, such an opportunity might be hard to pass up. Of course, this ruin hides all manner of secrets, one of which is a spell key. 3,000 years ago, we might have needed a whole host of mages to break its hold on the door, but now, it's a brittle relic. Exactly. The Daedra must have sensed the fragility of the key and empowered the Focus Stones to protect it. There's something akin to Welkin Stones, albeit larger and more unstable. It shouldn't take much effort to break them. Well, yes, there's the spiders, but I'm sure there'll be no trouble for a hero of your stature. As far as the strength of the ward, the Daedra probably didn't have time to prepare. It may simply be stalling until it can complete its ritual. Yes, it's complicated. I apologize for being vague, but every minute we spend talking is another minute that my sister is in danger. I promise you I'll explain more when you've dealt with the Focus Stones. You made it. And I sense that the Focus Stones have been dealt with? Well done, hero. Now that the Focus Stones are destroyed, I can deal with this infernal spell key. We should be able to enter the ruins in short order. As I said before, the spell key is a brittle and aged relic. I'll weave a simple enchantment, and that should be the end of it. Take care, my friend. The spell key is going to become unstable. The effects may be explosive. Now, we have some grim business to discuss. I pray that you will have the strength of will to see this through. It's the ritual. I did not have the heart to speak of it before, but I can't put it off any longer. That fool Najan told me that the Daedra has been abducting people. It is, no doubt, collecting them for a summoning ritual. Yes, it plans to summon its true form here, to Mundus. It will need living sacrifices to do so. We have to... Deprive it of those living offerings. Please, do not think of it as murder. Look around. These people were dragged below by some of the most venomous spiders in all of Tamriel. The toxins they were injected with. Victims do not recover from such encounters. None. They are beyond help. I beg you to look on this as a kindness. Their souls will find more comfort in Aetherius, I assure you. Take my talisman. It will make it easier. Use it on any victims you find, be a true hero, and set them free. That should do it. We can enter the ruins now.
I know you have the strength to see this through. Is that you? Oh, beloved Rupka, help me! It can't be! Anexial, please! I beg you for Morwa's mercy! Release my sister! It pains me, but we cannot take her pleas to heart, my friend. The Daedra will try anything. Speak to it if you want, but you know what we have to do. Oh, stranger. What have you done? The woman you are escorting, a oh, wayfarer, she is not my sister. The Daedra Anexial has taken control of her. Can you not see it? Yes, I'm sorry. Forgive me. When my sister heard that I had been taken by a Daedra, she came to rescue me. I was possessed for... I don't know... hours? Days? Weeks? My memory... It's nothing but screaming and dancing shadows. It's... all so foggy... muddled. She drew the creature out of me and into herself. She was gritting her teeth and screaming. Oh, it was horrible. She said she was going to put up wards before the creature overtook her to keep the monster out. Yes, yes, Wayfarer, just so. Don't let it win. Silence, creature. Adina's the one possessed. The Daedra is trying to trick you. Don't believe its lies. No, you must believe me. You can't let it finish the ritual! You can't! So long as that thing lives, so does the ritual. You have to kill it to end this. Please, listen to me. If the ritual completes, who knows how many innocent lives may be lost? We can't wait any longer. She's already free of her bonds. Please, in Rupka's name, use the talisman and release her! Have I not earned your trust? I've had countless opportunities to attack you, to slay you, but I haven't. Did I not tell you that Mafala is the Prince of Secrets, the spinner of lies and mistrust? You are being deceived. You must act. Look into your heart. Have you been wrong this whole time? Is your compass that broken? I don't offer comfort, but I do offer truth. My sister is lost to that thing. It breaks my heart. But we must finish what we started. The choice is yours. Listen to me, Wayfarer, please. That is not my sister. Not anymore. You can't believe it's lies. It's... it's manipulating you. Because what I'm saying is true. Oh, I've never been good at speaking my mind. Please, stranger, think of what you've done. If there was, I would have told you already. What's that in your hand? Is that her talisman? In my trance, I heard a voice. 
when it wasn't screaming. It whispered about a talisman, a talisman just like that. If you use it on my sister, it might draw the creature out. breath. What have we done? I don't know. I thought it needed me, but Azara was my twin. We were bound by blood. It must have been enough. To Waka, be kind. Yes, it might still be weak from the summoning. Onsi protect you. I'll see to my sister. So free of the web. <laughs> what a delightful fiction. Oh, yes. Come closer. Mm, how strong you look with my minion's blood on your hands. Hmm. Someone as mighty and well-traveled as you might already know. I am Mephala, the Lady of Whispers. A fair question. I don't often come to greet those who would slay my servants. But you, oh, there's something different about you. The scarred wrists of a cold harbor slave, yet... Such a regal bearing. Trying to do? Oh, no. <laughs> you strong, beautiful fool. Do you think she failed? A marriage ruined. A sister slain. Souls lost. Families broken. And to think, all of this began with a wayward goat. <laughs> What a gorgeous and horrifying tapestry. What a predictably mortal question. Small, great, the same. Each thread tugs the other. Petty jealousy, an unintended slight, dog-like lusts. These are the things that bring empires to ruin. Think on this, my dear. I'll be watching. Did you kill that thing? That sounds like an ill omen. Mephala spoke to you? The Daedric Prince? I hope for your sake that it was something else. Let's get out of here. I can't bear to stay here any longer. Have you seen my husband, Najan? We should go to him. In all our long years together, I never raised my voice or called him out on a lie. I cooked his food, I cleaned his shirts, I minded his goats when he was away. 
I did all of this gladly, but no longer. Yes, I want him to know about the suffering. My suffering and my sister's. For once in my life, I want him to truly see me, so he'll know what he's done. Dina, my love, thank the eight you're safe. Hold your miserable tongue, Snake. I'll not hear more of your lies. Dina, it was all my fault. I know. Zit's tears, I'm so sorry. I didn't know. I didn't. You lusted after a Daedra, you filthy cur. A Daedra. After all I've done, all I've sacrificed for you. I know. I know I failed you. Failed us. But if you'd only... No, Najan. I will not. Perhaps if you'd come and face the monster yourself. But instead, you sent my sister? Izara is dead because of you. Dead? By the eight, Athena. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Adina. Please speak to me. I've lost everything. I... I don't know. Just don't know. Adina, my desert star, I've lost her forever and for what? Not until after it killed the woman I sent into harm's way. Izara faced spiders, Daedra, ancient magic. All I did was stand here and bleat like a lamb, afraid to face the thing I set free. Ancestors, forgive me. Yes, of course. I'm sorry. For everything. Gods, what have I done? It's good to be free of him. With my sister gone, there's nothing keeping me here. I have never seen the sea. Perhaps my days in Bangor I are over. Adina may forgive me in time, but I will never forgive myself. <laughs> 